Meghan Markle wore a black Givenchy coat to the Association of Commonwealth Universities. The Duchess looked chic as she visited her new patronage. Over the past few weeks, Meghan Markle has been visiting each of her four new patronages and today, the Duchess rounded out the list with a trip to the Association of Commonwealth Universities. Meghan recycled a chic black Givenchy coat for the occasion, which she styled with a sleek top knot bun, nude heels, and a pair of earrings by Dean Davidson. The Duchess first wore the coat to a Remembrance Day service at the Cenotaph in November. See the full look here. During this morning's engagement, Meghan will meet with students and academics from the Association of Commonwealth Universities' 500 member institutions. Today marks the first time Meghan has publicly visited the Association of Commonwealth Universities. The Association of Commonwealth Universities is an interesting one because, to me, that clearly reflects Meghan's interest in education and education for all, which we know that she is passionate about. Royal reporter Victoria Murphy previously told Town and Country of Meghan's new role with the AQ. I think it also reflects the fact that she and Harry are going to have very prominent roles within the Commonwealth moving forward. Backslash last year, Prince Harry took on the role of Commonwealth Youth Ambassador, another indication of how paramount the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's roles are to the royal family's work supporting the Commonwealth. Given how strongly Queen Elizabeth feels about the Commonwealth, Meghan taking on this patronage is also indicative of the monarch's trust in her new granddaughter-in-law. I think the fact that two of Meghan's patronages have been given to her by the Queen so early on in her royal career especially ones that the Queen has held for a very long time is definitely an endorsement of Meghan's work within the family, Murphy says. In recent weeks, the Duchess has been busy with events at her three other patronages. In addition to the AQ, Meghan took over the Queen's patronage of the National Theatre and added two new organizations to her roster, SmartWorks and Mayhew. The Duchess previously made appearances at both SmartWorks and Mayhew earlier this month and visited the National Theatre yesterday wearing a stunning a pale pink Brandon Maxwell dress. But Meghan's full schedule shouldn't come as a surprise to royal fans. As Vanity Fair previously reported, the Duchess plans to work as close to her due date this spring as possible. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to get instant news update.